Hey, it's Zach from Pensacola, Florida. Tonight we've been frying up catfish in our Instapot Vortex air fryer. Um, I kind of explained to you how we fry fish down here in the south, and I'm going to give you a little kicker recipe that we use. Um, whenever we're frying up catfish, it's always in cornmeal. Uh, if we're frying mullet or any other kind of fish, we'll use a, a, you know, another uh, fish fry recipe. But when you're talking about catfish, it's always in cornmeal. And what we do is we season the cornmeal. Um, you can use, some people use lemon pepper, uh, whatever you want. I like Cajun seasoning. I like Slap Your Mama. Uh, it's got a real good flavor. It's got salt, pepper, garlic um, in there. I think red pepper. Uh, so it's got a real good flavor. So that's how I like to season my cornmeal. Now, I've already got some in there, so I'm not going to put, um, I'm not going to put much in. Because again, it's already has some in it. Shut this. That all this stuff. Yeah. All right. Tonight's recipe is hot fried catfish. Now I saved a few. I saved about a pound out of the, the last batch I did. What I do? I took Crystal's hot sauce. Now, it's not really that hot, but it's got a good base flavor to it. So I put some Crystal's hot sauce in this bowl right here um, for the base flavor, and I kicked it up just a little bit. And slap your mama hot sauce. Now you can use whatever hot sauce you want, um, but I happen to love slap your mama. So I, I hit a couple shots of it in, you know, in, in that. So now I've got got it soaked in the crystals, hot sauce, and slap your mama. Now I'm going to take these, and these two are just for purpose of the video. I've got more that I'm going to do. Alright, shake those around there. Get a good, good coating. See how it's got a good coating to it so we're even. Get that just a bit more. Okay. I'm going to finish it up with the rest of the catfish and we'll be back to show you how to work the, the uh, air fryer. Alright, we got all my fish breaded. Again, I dipped them in Crystal's hot sauce with a couple hits of uh, Slap Your Mama um, and then rolled into cornmeal. So what I'm going to do with this, this air fryer, hit the air fryer function. Temperature set on 400, that's what I want on. I did 11 minutes. When I did the uh, the last catfish, I want to bump it up because these are a little bit wet. Um, so I'm going to bump it up to 13 minutes and hit the start button. Now it's going to preheat, and then it's going to once it's done preheating, it's going to tell me, you know, add the food. So I'll put the food. I got one rack. I'll put one rack on top, one rack on bottom. By halfway through, it's going to say turn food. So all I'll do is I'll open this and I'll I'll switch to two trays. I'll put the bottom one on top, top one on bottom, um, and then close it back and it'll, it'll continue to cycle until it gets to the 14 to 13 minutes so this is southern hot fried catfish and I'll show what it looks like when, we're, when it's done all right it went to 13 minutes uh, about halfway through a little more than halfway through it gave me the notification to turn the food to open the door and I just switched the trays and put it back it continued with the you know with the time uh, these are really tasty I've already had a piece um, there's a they're really crisp the little bit of the breading on some of it, but not much. Um, let's see a little bit there, but uh, but these have a really good taste to it. That crystals, that crystal sauce with that little extra slappy mama uh, gave these, you know, gave these catfish a, a really good taste. So, um, all right, next time.